Hello friends, this is Abhishek Agrawal here and in this particular tutorial, I am going to show you how to use power copy and user feature command in Gadia V5. These are one of the most important tools in Gadia V5 and it is generally used when you need to avoid the repetition of the certain set of features which you will be applying on different parts. I will quickly show you one demonstration on how to use power copy and user feature command. What I am going to do here is that I will create a solid body uh, with the multiple edges. I will extract all those edges to create a wireframe model of the same, same figure. Then I'll, I'll apply some, some set of operations on particular edge and I'll show you how to, how to copy these set of operations for different edges also by using a power copy command. So to start with it, go to start, mechanical design, part design over here. You can name the part as power copy demonstration. First of all, we will start with the solid figure. To, to start with it, select a YZ plane over here and go to sketch. We will create a body of a car as a solid figure as it has multiple edges. So start with it. As you can see, our approximate car body is created. Now we will exit from this sketch and select the pad command over here. We will give a length of 50 mm on either side. That would be sufficient. So click OK. Now what we will do, we will extract all its edges to get the wireframe model of the same figure. To do that, we have to create a new geometrical set. So name the geometrical set as extracted edge. Now to extract multiple edges, we have to switch our workbench and we have to go to the wireframe surface design workbench over here. We'll double click on the ex extracted edge geometrical set to get it into the workbench. Now we'll go to insert and operation command. Here you can see a extract command over here. So we'll select the extract command and we'll select all of the edges which we need to extract. So we'll start from here. Make sure you don't miss any edges. So there are total 24 edges which, is, which needs to be extracted. So if you click OK, you can see uh, edges uh, in the white border which are extracted from the solid figure. Now if you hide the solid figure, you can see the wireframe model of the same figure. So here we are, complete with the wireframe model. Further operation will be continued in the next part where I will be applying certain set of operation on particular edge and these operations will be copied to other edges also by using power copy command. So keep watching my tutorial. Thank you very much.